Meet Dr. David B. Samadhi, world-renowned prostate cancer expert and robotic prostatectomy surgeon. In 2013, 238,590 men will be diagnosed with prostate cancer. Almost 29,720 men will die from prostate cancer. One in six men will be diagnosed with prostate cancer in their lives. The average age of prostate cancer diagnosis is 67. Prostate cancer is the second leading cause of cancer death behind lung cancer. Traditional surgery, open prostatectomy, involves putting the patient under general anesthesia and making an incision in your lower abdomen. The surgeon removes the prostate while attempting to preserve the two nerve bundles responsible for sexual potency. The disadvantage of this approach is the blood loss involved and the rates of impotence post-operation, which approach 57% 18 months after treatment. Robotic-assisted laparoscopic prostatectomy is the most common form of treatment and the most successful, with survival rates 40 to 60% higher than those seen with traditional radiation treatments. The treatment is minimally invasive, with less blood loss, shorter hospital stays, and a much faster recovery. The Da Vinci surgical platform allows a finer degree of surgical precision and presents the patient with the best chance at preserving their erectile function and urinary continence. 85% of Dr. Samadhi's patients regain sexual potency, and 96 report continence within 12 months of surgery. External beam radiation treatment involves aiming beams of radiation at your prostate five days a week for seven to nine weeks. The drawbacks of this treatment are the overwhelming side effects. Patients report bowel and urinary complications after treatment, and sometimes for the rest of their lives. Impotence is also a great concern, with impotence rates of 75% after five years post-op. Patients also report fatigue during treatment and fluid buildup in the genitals and legs. Watchful waiting. As many as 50% of men diagnosed with prostate cancer have a low risk form of the disease, not requiring immediate treatment. Actively monitoring one's PSA and undergoing annual DREs is a must when monitoring a prostate at risk. The greatest concern is that the cancer will grow and spread to other parts of the patient's body. Dr. David Samadhi is Vice Chairman at the Department of Urology and Chief of Robotics and Minimally Invasive Surgery at the Mount Sinai Medical Center in New York. To date, he's performed more than 4,500 successful robotic prostatectomy procedures.